In this video I want to show you how to set up program settings. Before doing this you obviously have to have assigned your bicoders to zones and configured your zone run times and other zone settings uh, which are both explained in other videos. To set up your program turn your dial to the programs dial position. In this screen you'll see you have a number of options. We can set up program start times, configure our start days or our day intervals. Uh, we have program water windows and then we have a couple of other settings which is concurrent zone settings and then advanced program setup. To set up a program start time highlight the square blue and press enter. You'll notice that I have uh, the program here that I want to set the, the start time for I can change that with my plus or minus key and then I have eight start times that I can set simply by pressing the next button to highlight the box and using plus or minus to change the start time. We'll put this to 4 a.m. for this example. So program one has a start time of 4 a.m. Once I've set my start times for the program, I can then go down with my next key to start day setup, press enter. Again, I select the program in the upper box, change that with the plus or minus key, and then I have a couple of options. The first option is days of the week. You can see here below it that I can set a yes or a no for each day of the week, which will allow or disallow watering starts on that day. I also, by pressing the plus or the minus key, can go to a straight interval. So I have a schedule type as interval days. The next, I can actually tell it how many days to wait or what day I want it to start that interval and then the number of days in between watering. Let's set this to two. You notice that uh, it defaulted to tomorrow's date in this case. The next option that I have is the water window setup. Press next down to highlight it and press enter to go into that screen. Again, I select the program in the first box. I have two options. I can set the water window for the whole week, which is weekly. By pressing plus, I can change it for each day of the week individually. Let's go ahead and set this to weekly for this example. I can use my next button. You'll see here that it, it goes down and if I wanted to turn it off, not allow watering after the hours of 7 a.m., I'm going to use my minus or plus key and my next button to change the hours and so between 7 and noon the boxes are white and the controller will not allow watering dur that, during that time. Once I've got my program water set up for the program, I can go back use my next button down to the concurrent zones setup. In this screen I've got a column on the left which is the program number and then on the column on the right I have the number of maximum zones I want to allow to run at one time for that program. Let's say for program one I have enough water that I'm going to allow it to water three zones at a time. With my next key come down to the total allowed box which is the total number of zones allowed on the entire system uh, across all programs. I'm going to set this to three because the controller will water the lesser of those two numbers. The smallest number will be the maximum number of zones that can turn on. Once I've set that setting all done, I'm going to press the back key and go into advanced programs setup. This is a 3200 only feature. Uh, it's something unique to baseline. We're going to press enter and you can see I select the program. I can disable the program if I want. The reason you would disable a program is if you had a seasonal program, a grow-in program, a fertigation program, or some other reason that you wanted to save all of the zones and the program settings for that program without having to actually use the program except when you want to. You can simply disable the program, re-enable it when you want to use it, and then disable it when you're done. The, th the Base Station 3200 also gives you the ability to prioritize your program. The 3200 will always water higher priority programs before it will try and water medium priority programs. And it will water those higher priority programs to done. If you have parts of your landscape that are higher priority and you want to make sure stay green, and maybe you've got some areas in the back of the property that you're not as concerned with, you can set those to high and the ones in the back to a lower priority. You have high, medium, and low priorities in this section. Those are all of the program setup options in the program's dial position of the Base Station 3200. Thanks for watching.